we get a lot of requests from the field on how to rig a rescue hauler. And if we have the pulleys that parallel with each other, it becomes a problem because the rope can twist and cause friction and make it impossible to lift the load. It is necessary to turn one pulley on a quarter turn to the other pulley, and this prevents a lot of that twisting. First thing I want to do is attach the rope to the upper part of the rescue hauler. I'm going to take the rope that comes out of the rope bag. I will put it into the rope guide, release the cam so it will not be allowed to move. Then I will bring the rope over the top of the forward side of the pulley, form a loop, and bring it back over the top of the rear pulley. This will form a loop on one side of the rescue hauler. That loop is going to be placed around the lower pulley, which is turned at a, on a quarter turn. I will then take the rope that is through the back part of the pulley and rig it through the other side of the lower pulley. At that point, I'll place a carabiner into the pulley so that I don't lose what I've already gained. Now, I have plenty of rope here because I don't want to be uh, coming up short when I'm doing this uh, rigging. So what I'm going to do at this point is tie a barrel knot and slide it up onto the rescue hauler. Because I have extra rope to work with, I do have some extra slack in here, so the next thing I'm going to do is pull that slack out, and then I can just move this up, and we have the thing rigged on a quarter turn, which is the way it will have to be if you're going to prevent the twisting. 